hello friends welcome back to my youtube channel today we'll be looking at angles and types of angles in engineering we will be identifying the different types of angles used in engineering drawing friends subscribe to my channel hit the like button share like and comment in the comment section what you feel about this video what is an angle an angle is defined as there to be formed when two rays as lines razor lines meet or intersect at a common end point that's when two lines meet they form an angle parts of an angle we have the arms or the side there are two straight lines or segments we have the vertex it's a point where the arms and the lines meet and lastly the angle is the measure of the rotation between the initial and the final position of the arms angle based on range of the angle we have acute angle which is less than 90 degrees we have the right angle which is equal to 90 degrees we have the obtuse angle which is greater than 90 but less than 180 degrees we have the straight angle that is just okay that's a straight line that is 180 degrees we have the reflex angle which is greater than 180 degrees but less than 360 degrees we have the full rotation angle that's a kind of a circle that is 360 degrees as you can see the illustration of the ranges of the angles the acute angle the right angle the obtuse angle the straight angle or the straight line the reflex and the full rotation types of angles in engineering we have the angle zero degrees we have the angle 30 degrees we have the angle 45 degrees angle 60 degrees angle 90 degrees angle 180 degrees and angle 360 degrees these are the basic types of angles in engineering other angles can be formed from these angles we will talk about this in a later section of this video angle 30 and angle 60 degrees the 30 degrees and 60 degrees set square can be used to construct an angle of 30 and 60 degrees respectively angle 45 and 90 degrees the 45 degrees set square can be used to construct angles 90 and 45 angle 180 degrees angle 180 degree can be constructed just by drawing a straight line with the help of a ruler or a t-square as shown angle 0 and 360 degrees angle 0 and 360 degrees are regarded as angle at a point angle 0 degrees is used to denote an angle where there is no rotation while angle 360 is used to denote an angle of full rotation bisecting an angle angles can be divided into two equal parts with the help of a compass thereby making it easy to obtain angles like for example if you bisect angle 30 you get angle 15 and also bisecting 15 you get 7.5 degrees and so on similarly when 45 degrees is bisected you will get 22.5 degrees bisection of angles is applicable to all angles irrespective of their degrees watch my bisecting videos to learn how to bisect angles friends subscribe to my channel hit the like button share like and comment in the comment section what you feel about this video